Maybe you say to yourself, I love you. Come on, Teddy, it's time. Hi, friends. I'm so glad you're here today. Thanks for joining my friend Teddy and I for our Mooka moment. When we practice our Mooka, we have just one rule. Mm -hmm, just one. Do you have any guess? Teddy, do you know our one rule in our Mooka moment? Mm -hmm. It's to be kind. When we practice our Mooka, it's important to always be kind. And there's three pieces to this rule. First, we're kind to ourselves. We say nice things to ourselves. We take care of our bodies. Second, we're kind to each other. We say nice things to each other. We take care of each other. And the third is we're kind to our earth for where we are. And I have a song to help us. It goes like this. I am kind to me. I am kind to you. I am kind to the earth. I am kind to me, I am kind to you, I am kind to the earth too. I am kind to me, I am kind to you, I am kind to the earth too. One more time. I am kind to me, I am kind to you, I am kind to the earth too. Thanks for singing with me. When we practice our mukha, it's important to be kind to ourselves during the whole practice. Practicing our mukha is an opportunity for us to do something kind for ourselves. We move and breathe and rest and sit. That takes care of our body, our mind, and our heart. It's as important as brushing your teeth every day. Teddy, are you able to try a mukha moment with me today? Oh good, I'm so glad. Are you ready to try? Great. First, we move, then breathe, and rest, then sit. Come on, Teddy, it's time. First we move, then we breathe and rest, then sit. First we move, then we breathe and rest, then sit. First we move, then we breathe and rest, then sit. First we move, then we breathe and rest and sit. First, we move. Stand up really tall, friends. Show me your mountain pose. Stomp your feet on the earth. Can you hear it? Stomp, 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 stomp. And then let's reach our hands up to the sky. Reach even more. Big good morning stretch. Oh, what a kind choice for our body this morning. Reach, reach, reach. Let's turn into a crescent moon. We're gonna lean to one side, crescent moon. We'll reach back up to the sun and over to the other side, crescent moon. Come back up to the sun, reach a little more, and then elephant trunk. Can you go down towards the earth and become an elephant trunk? You could shake your head, your arms. What sound does that elephant make? From here, we're gonna come all the way down to the earth. Can you show me easy pose, crisscross applesauce? Easy pose. Stretch out your arms to either side. We're gonna lean to one side, and then push up and lean to the other side. Tick, tock, tick, tock. That's right, like a clock. Tick, tock. Can you go faster? shoulders and draw a big circle with your elbow. 
Yeah, like you're flapping your chicken wings. Can you flap them faster? <sighs> and slow, all the way up and down. <sighs> <sighs> Next, let's twist our spine. Ready, Teddy? Twist, twist, twist. Twist, 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 like a washing machine. Twist, 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 twist. Let's put our legs now in a butterfly. Put some glue on the bottom of your feet and stick them together. Now I have wings. Flap your wings. We're going to keep our legs and butterfly and we're going to find our heart. Teddy, where's your heart? That's right, right there in the middle of your chest. Inside our hearts we have love and kindness. That's what we're working on today, kindness. Sometimes we just got to wake it up though. It's always there but maybe we need to wake it up. Here's how you wake up your heart. tingling. I can feel all that love and kindness in there. Next, let's stretch our legs all the way out. You can move your ankles, wiggle your toes. We'll reach up to the clouds, tickle the clouds, and tickle your toes. Reach up high, tickle the clouds, and tickle your toes. Tip, toe, tip, Toe, tip, toe, toes. One more time. Tip, toe, tip, toe, tip, toe, toes. Imagine like this is your caterpillar and it's inching in the grass. Maybe it's eating. What is your caterpillar eating today? Mmm, yum. Inch, inch, inch. Oh, now your caterpillar is feeling very full and hung and tired. It's going to climb the tree and it's going to curl itself up into a little ball and wrap itself up. What is this? That's right, the cocoon. Give yourself this big hug and maybe you say to yourself, I love you. I love you. I love me. I love you. And then what happens next? That's right, we come into a butterfly. Flap your wings. Can you smell your toes? Ooh, stinky toes. We can fly up, 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 up with the clouds and down, 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 down to the earth. Next, let's come on to our hands and knees. We can find a cow, moo, and a cat, meow. Cow and cat. Can we move and breathe together? Big breath in, big breath out. <sighs> big breath in, big breath out. Can we find a down dog? Can you go upside down today? Whoa! You could shake your head, bend your knees, you could even jump. Can you try and jump your toes off the earth? Great practicing, friends. Next, we'll stand all the way up to the sky again all the way up to our feet. We're gonna practice our warrior poses. Warriors are strong. They're also pretty kind. Today we're gonna find kind warriors. We're gonna spread our feet apart and we're gonna reach our hands first up to the sky. Can you keep your back leg straight and bend the front knee? 
In this posture, we can say to ourselves, I am kind to me. Then let's take our hands out to either side and we could point our fingers. In this posture, we could say, I am kind to you. Next, we'll lean back and point up to the stars. And in this posture, we can say, I am kind to the earth, too. <sighs> shake that one out, shake your body. We're gonna try the other side. So we're gonna have to flip our feet. Reach up high to the sky. My back leg is straight, my front knee bends. I am kind to me. I am kind to you. I am kind to the earth, too. And shake that one up. Great trying with me today, friends. Let's do one more. Hmm, what should we do, Teddy? What other movement do we want to do today? You want to jump around. Would you like to jump around? Some frog jumps? Okay, let's come down to a squat and try and jump as high as we can. Three, two, one, jump! Whoa, check your feet. Did you land back where you started? Let's do another. Three, two, one, jump! Can you try a tuck jump? A tuck jump, we start standing. We're gonna jump up and try and bring our knees to our belly, like this. Can you try? One more time. Great tuck jump. Thanks for moving with me, friends. Let's get ready to breathe. First we move, then we breathe and rest and sit. Come on down back to easy pose, crisscross applesauce. Remember, our lungs are in our chest, so we want to sit proud. If we slouch, it compresses or squishes our lungs. So sit proud so you can breathe in as much clean oxygen as you can. <sighs> Today in our breathing, we're going to practice a stress breath, a kind choice for ourselves when we notice if we have stress in our body or in our days is to give ourselves big, deep breaths to help us calm down. We're gonna use our breathing ball to help. A stress breath works like this. You breathe into the belly, filling up, and then pause. Can you tuck your chin and hold the breath? And then let it out slow. <sighs> That's a stress breath. Let's do some together. Big breath in. Hold it, let it go. <sighs> Big breath in, maybe you can tuck the chin, hold it, and let it go. <sighs> Inhale deep, hold it, exhale slowly. you feel. Thanks for breathing with me, Teddy. Let's get ready to rest. First we move, then we breathe and rest and sit. We're going to come all the way down to our backs. Can you stretch out your legs, stretch out your arms like a starfish? 
Ah, resting on a rock. You can feel the warm sunshine. Ah. In today's rest, we're going to practice a squeeze and let go. Let's start with our hands. Squeeze your hands into a fist. Squeeze, 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 and then let them go. Squeeze your hands and your arms and your shoulders. Squeeze, 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 and then let them rest. Ah. Can we do hands, arms, shoulders, and back and belly? Can you squeeze, 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 and let it go? Ah. Let's try the feet now. Can you squeeze just the toes and the feet? And let it go. Can we squeeze the toes and the legs? Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. And let it go. What about the feet and the legs and the bottom and the chest and the belly and the back? Squeeze. And let it go. What if we try the whole body? Shoulders, toes, legs, bottom, back, belly, and face. Can you scrunch your face? Squeeze everything. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. And let it go. <sighs> Let's try that one more time. Hands, arms, feet, legs, back, belly, face, whole body. Squeeze. And let it go. <sighs> let it go. Let it go. Melting, melting, melting into the earth. <sighs> See if you can now relax your whole body. And maybe as you exhale and breathe out, you can let go a little more. Four, three, two, one. Slowly and when you are ready, we'll wiggle our fingers, our toes. Ah, maybe bring your knees in, give yourself another hug. And now it's time to sit. First we move, then we breathe and rest and sit. Find easy pose one more time, friends. We move and breathe and rest so that we can sit. We try and get really still. But of course, you're still alive and breathing. Can you feel your breath moving your body? In today's sit practice, we're going to do I am. When you breathe in, you can say to yourself, I am. And then when you breathe out, try and say something kind to yourself. It could be, I am kind. I am kind. I am unique. I am strong. I am a friend. I am generous. I am me. Thanks for practicing with me today, Teddy. When we are kind to ourselves, it helps us be kind to each other. In practicing a mukha moment, 
is being very kind to yourself. How are you feeling now, Teddy? How are you feeling? We know all feelings don't last forever, and whatever you're feeling is okay. And all you need to practice your mukha is your body, your mind, and your heart, which are always with you. Thank you for practicing with me. I like to feel as strong as a tree, calm as the sea, happy and free to move and breathe and just be me. It's time for a mooka moment.